Welcome to PyData Amsterdam 2018. Uh, did you have coffee? Yes. Did you enjoy the view? Yes. Great. There's a spot where the students can get on the stage, where sort of an academic can get on the stage, where the industry person can get on the stage, and the open source toolmaker can get on the stage. And just that sort of lovely chaotic mix uh, makes for a very joyful and interesting conference at the same time. So my talk was about the GDPR. And we talked about the regulation and about some steps that companies can take to assess their readiness for it. And also a background on where it all came from. General the presentation was about the Air app, uh, a web and mobile app which displays air pollution data from Macedonia. Uh, polluted usually 20 times over the EU limit during winters. And it's very, very important to get this data out there because with some sort of data activism like this, we've been able uh, to trigger a 3,000 strong movement of protesters. Three, two. We got three days. We had a workshop day uh, where it was sort of a longer talk and more of a tutorial setting. Talking about a large open source project called Raza that is focusing on machine learning applied for dialogue handling, for message analytics, to really provide chatbots with the knowledge they need to answer user queries. Oh my god, there was a Pokemon talk? Um, no, okay, I did not go to the Pokemon talk, so my day was bad set up a test for a data set, it's running, everything's fine for like two years and then out of nowhere it starts failing and you're like, why the heck did I put this test here in the first place? Like I can't remember why I, I put this here. And so that struggle um, is a lot of what it, uh, sort of drove the development of Marbles. I talked about medical data science and why it's really cool to work in that field, but also the challenges poses, so why it also sometimes kind of can suck because things are slow and it's hard to get data. What made me come back, not just the view, but also because I've been wanting to speak here for a long time, so it's really exciting to actually be here and speak, but I'll be honest, I mean, I love the city, I love the venue, I love the food, good talks, nice people, what's not to come, and this year, Stroopwafels are the damn best, man. Perfect. <laughs>